Hey everyone, so today I'm going to talk about one of our software friend connector and how does it work on the Facebook new UI. Yes, um, friend connector works for the new UI that Facebook just released and I'm going to show you that how can you use it on the Facebook new UI and why is it helpful for your business or why it is going to be beneficial for your business. So before I jump into all this, let me ask you one question. Who does not want leads for their business? Me, me, me. The answer to this question will be always yes, I want leads because that's the number one, that's the like one of the important thing to start a business and to survive in a business. Now you can spend a lot of your money on ads to get leads, okay? Or you can spend a little bit of money for using this software, which will help you to get leads from one of our favorite platform, Facebook. So what is Friend Connector, okay? It's a Chrome extension, okay? It's a, it's a Chrome extension that sits on your Chrome browser and help you to send a friend request to your targeted niche on autopilot while you can play with your kids or you can help your spouse with household stuff or you can do whatever you need to, you need to put your time, uh, time at, okay? Now, you must be wondering, what, how is it even possible? So let me show you how, okay? So as you can see that I am on the Facebook new UI right now and I am going to show you how can you run this Chrome extension on the Facebook new UI and how, why you should, like why should you run this extension uh, which will help you in your business, okay? So first thing first, you need to go to the friend, uh, Chrome store and you need to add this Chrome extension, Friend Connector Pro. When you, after you add it to your Chrome, you should be able to see the icon, a little icon like this on your Chrome extent, on your Chrome browser, okay? The next thing you need to keep in mind that Friend Connector works from three places. First one is group. Yes, Facebook group plays a big role here because as you, if you are doing business on Facebook, then you must be knowing how important groups are. So to be able to run this Chrome extension in Facebook group and to be able to send the send friend request to its group members, you need to find your target groups because that's the first thing you need to do, okay? So first thing you need to find, you need to uh, analyze who are your target audience. Once you do that, you need to see where are those people, are, okay? So which groups they are in, which groups your target audiences are at. So once you find those groups, you go to those groups, okay? Just like I am in this group right now, My Lifestyle Academy Mastermind, I'm in this group. I'm going to go to the group and I am already in the group and I'm going to uh, go to its members area and I'm going to run this Chrome extension to do my work. As I said, you this can be your one of your best friends if you know how to run it, okay? Because this is going to help you a lot. So. I go to this extension, I log in with my credentials here and after you log in with your credentials, you will be able to see this screen of Friend Connector, okay? Where you will get all these options, uh, lookup interval where you can select an interval, uh, request limit, then keywords and then message groups. So message groups are really helpful if you uh, want to grab attention. So if you want to create your messages, which I ha already have created, um, so I, I have just created a simple message like, hey, first name, I just saw your profile and think it would be a good to, uh, it would be good to have you as a connection. Hey, first name, another one I have created here, just came across your profile and think you can benefit from each other's business. So 
Keep in mind that this will be randomized. So you can add as many as segments you want. These all message will be randomized. So the first person, they uh, maybe he is going to get this one. The next one uh, might be going to, they might get this one, okay? This second message. So you should be able to add as many as message segments as you want. And then you have to create the group. So a group contains message segments and a group contains message segments then you can also um, add something like add a static text or keyword so you can add your you can create your group okay i have already created my group here so you should be able to add this group here so once you add the message group here as i said whenever they are going to get a friend request from your side like whenever this all these lovely people are going to get a friend request from your side they are also going to get a nice message that you have created for them, that you have personalized for them, okay? Now, keep in mind that uh, new features are coming on your way, which will let you create messages and send messages when you get a friend request, when you delete a friend request, when someone sends you a friend request, or when some... If, when you accept someone friend request or when someone else accept your friend request but those will be in our next version release so you don't have to worry about worry, worry about them right now okay so as i was saying that after you create your message or uh, groups you can select you can come to this screen and then you will be able to select a lookup interval I always suggest people to select minimum five minutes to 15 minutes because that's how you don't come into the Facebook radar, okay? For this testing, for this demo purpose, I'm going to select um, or like between 15 to 18 seconds. Then I'm going to select infinite, then resume from your last search, no. This is being, if you want to uh, resume from your last search. So if you are if you are using friend connector and uh, you have sent maybe uh, 500 people from, like you have sent 500 people a friend request from this group, right? And then you want to start from the next one. So you can actually give the number as 501, okay? So I'm going to just select as no, and then here you can actually give your use keywords. So if you want to, if you want to send friend requests to very specific people who are maybe the CEOs, maybe the founders, or whatever your targeted niche are, right? My for me, it's CEOs, founder, business owners, directors, affiliate marketers. So I just I have just added these keywords. It could be different for you. If, if you are into real estate and you go to a group which is, um, which is targeting real estate people, then you can, also add, you can also add keywords as real estate, buyers, sellers, whatever you want, okay? So you can use keywords to niche down of like to basically target people specifically who is having these keywords on their profile. So it's only going to send a friend request to these people whenever it will find any of these keywords in their profile, okay? And uh, otherwise it will avoid the rest of them, okay? So I have just used these keywords and I'm just going to, um, yeah, I'm just going to select a message group here and then just run the extension, okay? See, is, she is going to get a friend request because uh, she is having the keyword founder and I have used the keyword founder. So she is going to get a friend request and you are going to just see that in a, in a minute. And also she is going to get a message from my side. Hey Kate, I just saw your profile. Okay, she got one. Next one, I don't know where it is going. As I said, it's going to find, wherever it's going to find the keyword, then only it's going to send a friend request to that particular uh, person, okay? Until it finds, it, it will just load and load and load and until it finds the next person who is having that particular keyword. 
that's how that's how friend connector work from groups okay now it's going to do that as you can see it's again it just found another profile who is having ceo and it's going to send a friend request to this person so you can see we will see that just in a bit boom she got it hopefully yes and she is also going to get the message that hey i just saw your profile think it would be a good match okay so that's how friend connector work from groups now now i'm going to stop it and i'm going to show you the next place from where friend connector works as well so let me go to anyone's profile here who is in my friend list so let me go to ricky's profile okay and then see if his friend list is open to public so keep in mind that the second thing that i was saying you need to find your influencer you need to find the people that you follow and if what kind of influencer they are and the audiences that they have can you leverage their audiences or not so as for ricky if i i i see that hey ricky is ricky is also doing the same kind of stuff or in he is also into same kind of business and the friends that he has i can also target them because they are also kind of like my target audience so i can go to his profile i can go to his friends and if his friend list is open to public which in this case it's not so if his friend list is open to public i can just go to i i can just run friend connector and be done with it <laughs> let friend connector do its work so i have to find some other profile to actually show you so let's go to his profile okay and uh, let's see if his friend list is open or not yes his friend list is open to public so i can run friend connector from here as well in this, the same way that i have just uh, shown you that you can use any of these functionalities and i can just i can just run it so i'm just going to run it and then see what happens okay let me show you what this uh, functionality does okay so i'm going to just say i want to say start from 36 okay and then just run it just a second oh see i just sent this girl a friend request and she accepted and she also replied to my message because i sent a friend request with this message i just saw your profile and think it would be good to have you as a connection and then she just accepted and she said hey ankita so nice to meet you that's how that's why proof is that's how friend connector works and that's how that's how awesome it is because you can just get leads and this is literally my lead right and now if i am doing my own marketing right then i can easily convert this lead into a sell so that's that's why i say the friend connector is very important for your business if you want to get fresh leads every day for your business on autopilot you don't have to spend so much time to get these leads because you are using this awesome software so let me see if this oh i didn't stop it okay i guess i didn't stop it so i'll just let it send a friend request here and boom it just did okay next one also uh just send the next one jmore then chris karens 
and all these people they will all get a friend request from my side okay so i'm just going to stop it the next place friend connector runs is from your facebook suggested friend list so facebook actually like facebook algorithm actually shows you who are the people that you should be friends with okay so based on the facebook algorithm it does show you it does uh, suggest people that they should be uh, they should be in your friend list so as you as you are seeing like as you can see that it's showing me all these people that people you, you may know right and i can run friend connector from here as well the only difference is in this screen you are going to see uh, another parameter which is mutual friends greater than equals to or less than equals to so i can actually give a number here if i want to specify that i want to add people who is having more than certain number of mutual friends or less than certain number of mutual friends so i can easily say that hey i want greater than equals to 20 okay i want to add people from this list i want to add people who is having greater than 20 mutual friends and I can do the same thing. I can choose a group. I can give a number here. I can choose an interval, choose an interval, and then run the Chrome extension. And you are going to see that it is only going to send those people a friend request who is matching with my criteria, which is greater than equals to 20 mutual friends. So James is going to get a friend request. And he is also going to get a message from my side. Came across your profile. Think it would be good. Then Jasper is going to get one, but David is not going to get one. Okay. Jasper got my message, but David is not going to get one. This guy is not going to get one. He is not going to get one. He is not. She is not, it went directly to Larry because he matched with my criteria, which was having more than 20 mutual friends. As well, Christoph, uh, Christoph also will get a friend request from my side. So that's how, that's how friend connector works. I'm just going to stop it. And And that's that's all. That's pretty much all about friend connector. How friend how friend connector works and how you like why you should run it. As I have just shown you the example that I just send that person, send that girl, or send that lady a friend request all on autopilot. I didn't have to put my time to find that leads. Now you can obviously spend your time and click manually then add friend add friend add friend you can do that if you want but you can also save a lot of time and actually invest your time into something useful which is basically converting those leads converting those phrase leads that you are getting every day converting them to a cell if you are if you are actually doing business on your on your facebook and that's why you should run friend connector to like which will help you to get leads get fresh leads every day on autopilot you just run it every day and i know you can have maximum five like you can have five thousand friends on your facebook but five just keep just think think it like this like five thousand friends if you can convert even one percent or even ten percent of it and just think how how much my like how much that is going to be for your business so just think about it and that's why that's how useful and that's how beneficial friend connector is and you just saw that that lady just replied back with a message that hey Ankita nice to meet you now I can I can I can continue the conversation by you know by saying by sending more messages and I can slowly 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 funnel that lady into my process into my whatever I'm trying to sell here on Facebook, my product, my service, I can easily like slowly and easily funnel that person 
by providing value by doing my own attraction marketing so that's all friend that's all about friend connector as i said more of like more features are coming on your way you should be you will be uh, able to automate most of your messages in the next version when we release the next version but until then just enjoy using friend connector and let us know if you have any feedback or if you want us to work on any other features that you have in your mind and you think would be beneficial to build it so we will go and build it and yes we have 24 cross seven support so you can reach us to us anytime you want if you need any help if you uh need any help or if you have any confusion you can just reach to our support our support is amazing so so yeah just 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 enjoy using pen connector